It is a first for a dancing fundraiser in Johnstown. Dancing with the Stars for Autism is held every year. But for the first time this year, one couple proving to be an inspiration unlike any other. Melanie Gillespie met the couple and has more on their story tonight. Mel? Marty, I got an exclusive sneak peek of the two rehearsing at Sherry Lynn's Ballroom in Johnstown, and these two are breaking the mold for the Dancing with Autism event this year. Step by step, Tom Leap and Lauren Topar are perfecting the tango. But there's much more to this couple's routine than just playing the roles from Phantom of the Opera. When I was little, I wanted to go see a musical, and my parents took me to go see Phantom of the Opera. I was immediately hooked. The challenge for these two is more than just choreography. Lauren and Tom are both diagnosed with autism. People with disabilities don't have a lot of respect out there, and I'd like people to have respect for us. And, you know, we could function as well as any normal human beings can, like get a job, get married, have friends, and take ballroom dancing. And um, to show that everybody else who are autistic or have a neurological difference, that they can. Um, overcome obstacles. They have a lot of social deficits and with the when they're on the dance floor and they're doing this, you would never know. And it's just it's wonderful to see them both like that. They've spent the last eight weeks perfecting the steps to perform it at the Dancing with the Stars for Autism in Johnstown on Saturday. Lauren and Tom will be the first couple ever dancing with autism. The need is there for things like this to raise awareness, to show that they can blend in, fit in, and that they do belong in society that, you know, they have to, you know, modify, society has to accept, but everybody can accept them for what they are. Don't give up on your dreams, like go after them. If the, you want to be a ballroom dancer, work hard to be a ballroom dancer. If you want to be like something like maybe like a doctor, a lawyer, or even like work in an office and you want something like that, go for it. <laughs> Today was the last day to get tickets for dinner, but if you'd still like to attend Saturday's Dancing with the Stars for Autism event, you can watch as a bystander for 20 bucks. Reporting live, Melanie Gillespie, 6 News.